see you. Hello, hello, Facebook friends. How is everybody doing? Hey, Maria. Hi, Carol. Yeah, it's not much better in Jersey. It's really kind of ugh today. Happy Friday, though. Uh, smoky Friday here in Jersey, for sure. Um, hey, Marianne. It's been, you know, today. today's air quality was pretty bad. Um... I felt it like not necessarily yeah. in my chest, but in my eyes, like my eyes, I had trouble focusing outside today. Um, so hopefully, you know, I don't know. They said we're going to be, we'll be dealing with this for a while and hopefully everybody in Canada is okay. I don't know if there's anybody watching us from Canada. Um, but I don't know. Does it, do you guys get the smoke kind of out in Massachusetts, Carol? I don't know if you guys are feeling it too. It's very weird. Um, it, yeah, it's really, really affecting you more than you realize. It just looks like it's hazy outside, but it's yeah. really, you can feel it in your lungs. Um, and then you're like, we're like today, I'm like, we're tired. Is it because <laughs> of the smoke? I like, I don't know. It's just, it's a very weird uh, thing happening. But anyway, we're here. It's Allison. And I'm Jim. And we are back for Friday Night Live. The nice thing, though, it wasn't orange out today <laughs> no it was just gray <laughs> it was just very very gray uh yeah it's it's yeah and they're telling everybody to stay inside for sure make sure you know if you have respiratory problems to stay indoors uh that is the best to do and it's getting warmer it's actually starting to feel more like summer um 80 something degrees today uh which was, or 86 which actually was really nice hi from colorado oh peggy you're watching us really <laughs> while you're while you're being transported. Well, thank you for joining us. I hope everything is okay. Um, hope you're doing well. It's been uh, sorry, refilling my drink as we know I get thirsty. Turn the water. I talk too much. All right. Well, you take care of yourself, Peggy. Yes. Um, that's well. most important. But yeah, so it's been um, it's been a week. But like I said, it's finally feeling like summer a little bit more here in Jersey. I'm happy for that. Uh, finally able to get in the pool a little bit. Uh, it only takes till July. <laughs> oh my goodness. So now you're going for all your therapy. Well, good luck. That was a good move. A lot of people, uh, very happy after they have their knee replacement. So, yes. you know, wish you a speedy recovery. Happy healing. Yes. Happy healing. I like that. Happy healing. <laughs> <laughs> um, make sure you listen and do what they tell you to do. That's most important. But yeah, the last time we were here, I was we had to cut it short because I was not feeling good. Hi, Nancy. Hi, D. So, but feeling better. We're getting there. Like, like I said, except for the smoky day we're having today, it's been a little miserable. Can you believe though that we're July Fourth weekend? Oh, we forgot. Oh, we forgot we were supposed to wear something today. I, we forgot all about it. No, oh, if I pull it this way. All right, because it's the 4th of July weekend. Hi, Carol. We had 4th of July gear. <laughs> <laughs> Headgear, to, to, to be specific. Don't laugh at mine. <laughs> Actually, I should have gotten a little top hat. They didn't have one. I, it was on the floor, I saw one. Oh, did, I didn't but see it. But we walked past it, and Allison picked out this for me. <laughs> <laughs> but he, but the other option was pinwheels, so I, he didn't want to wear pinwheels. So you got sparklers on your head. You can have the crown. I don't know if you want the crown. No. But, all right. So we're, we're celebrating the 4th of July, although we're really not doing anything. So I don't know. So where do you guys go for fireworks? Do you guys see fireworks around you? Do you go anywhere? Um, you know, there's a lot of places in Jersey. So actually, we were in Red Bank this week, right on the Navasink River the the back of the Elks Lodge overlooks. So they do fireworks back there. They said they started selling tickets back in the beginning of May and sold out like that. I, said, I can only imagine 
how beautiful it is to see the, um, well, to be right on the water on like the that. water. Yeah. So pretty. Uh, so yeah, so that's actually, uh, exciting. Fireworks are fun. They're not fun for everybody. Understood. Um, they are beautiful to watch. Um, Montville Township. Well, good to know. My um, fairy children did not like mm -hmm. them. <laughs> My dog could care less. He could care less. He barks at the wind, not at fireworks. No. Comet barks at the airplane going by up above. He looks <laughs> up and barks. <laughs> he can care less about thunder, which I'm blessed. I know he doesn't. Uh, he doesn't bark at anything. But no, we haven't really gone to fight because we're usually on vacation the week of Fourth of July. So we get to see whatever fireworks happen. We don't go anywhere anymore for fireworks. Um, we used to go to Clark. Um, that just they just get very congested and very crowded. You know, it just and then everybody's leaving at once, so that kind of gets a little crazy. Um, you know how that mad rush to leave. Macy's is beautiful. I love watching Macy's. Hi, Sandy. Uh, oh, they post. Okay, yeah, it's pretty dry out there and probably windy right now, huh? So yeah, that's why they have to uh, you have to be careful. Um, but welcome. Thank you all for joining us today. So today we do have a whole bunch of stuff to show you. We are extending 25% off. Because it's a holiday. Because it's a holiday. Holiday. Um, <laughs> sorry. Don't really want to hear me sing. I know. And everybody has to send get well wishes to Madonna. Oh, uh, yes. Because it was scary for her to be in the hospital. Uh, for me, it was I know. heart wrenching. <laughs> you know, I know some people look and say, oh, good gravy. But yes. <laughs> When, especially when they said she was unresponsive. I'm like, oh, I don't know if something ever happened to her. I don't know. Well, if you didn't know, Madonna uh, went into the hospital this week with a bacterial infection. Apparently she was found unresponsive, and they rushed her to the uh, hospital. She went into ICU. I believe she was intubated. Um, so, so, But now she's doing okay. She was yes, released. I was scared. But she's getting ready <laughs> for her tour, so I wouldn't sur – wouldn't – be surprised if she got run down and then something kind of just attacked her system a little bit um, because she's not a spring chicken, Jim. So she has to be careful bouncing back from these things, you know. She is forever young in She's my forever eyes. young. Well, with all the plastic <laughs> surgery, she's forever young. <laughs> but anyway, we wish her well. We don't, we don't want to see anything happen to Madonna. So she just may have to take it easy on this tour a little bit, though, you know. Especially if it was in her lungs, you know, you want to make sure she's all rested and better before she starts putting in those long, long hours on yeah. tour and, tri you know, going from one city to the next. So we wish you well, Madonna. Um, but yeah, so everything tonight is 25% off. If you are a club member, uh, you will get 30% off. Of course, we have fun and games and we do have some items that are closeout deals. So these uh, discounts will be uh, greater than 30%. Hey, Christine. And so that'll be the final price. The price will be marked down as is. So we have a lot of stuff for you tonight. Uh, a lot of fun stuff. We got kind of got started a little bit late. Sorry about that. That was my bad. But yeah, we have lots of fun. So let me just tell you, if you're new on here, welcome. We're so glad that you're here. Make sure you say hi. Um, but if you are new, let me just tell you how this works. Every item is going to have a number associated with it. If you'd like to purchase the item, just comment the number in the comments. Kevin is checking from afar, and once he sees your comment, he will give you a blue check mark. Um, and if it, don't worry, if you don't see the check mark, we go back and watch everything, so no worries. Um, so that's that. And if you are new, again, welcome. And please, if you do make a purchase, please private message us your email address and your shipping address if you can so we can properly get that on its way to you and then that's pretty much it so we have like so we have fun and games we have some cute prizes for you tonight um at least we think they're cute something different <laughs> something different um we we think they're cute so hopefully you do too so i think what we're going to get started what are you doing <laughs> all right let's make sure we have our light so you guys can see everything properly. And again, everything is 25% off. It will, the discount will automatically be applied. The prices that I'm going to tell you are the regular retail prices. Again, the discount will be applied later. Okay. So first up, we're going to start off with some works by ABC Designs. Again, everything is 25% off. If you're a club member, you get your 30% off. 
So first, by works by ABC, this is six pages from 1603, and this is $8. So this is number one, six pages from 1603, and that's $8. Number one, it looks like tiles. Actually, they're really cute with like yellow lemons. I don't know, I'm on the lemon kick right now. <laughs> Something about lemons. So that is number one. I, I do that galvanized tray on my dining room table. And this is how crazy life has been. I literally just removed the Easter decorations <laughs> from that tray. Easter has been what, over for two months? Uh, so I finally put... Um, well, they could have been spring. Well, it said Easter. I was helping you. <laughs> <laughs> and it had carrots, those big carrots in it. Uh, so I finally moved over to my summer one, and I have a little sign that says Easy Breezy Lemon Squeezy and um, another little summer, you know, summer sign or whatever. And it's filled with fake lemons and oranges, but it just looks so blah. So I want to add some. Well, Shannon from Housewives of OC I know. says to put seven lemons in a, it's good luck. a bowl on your table or a counter. Well, there may be more than seven. but Oh, lots of good luck. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> and But... It needs something else. It needs like eucalyptus. So I bought some like fake lavender sprigs to kind of throw in there. So hopefully that'll liven it up. But I just did that. So that's my summer. So that'll be there till I put pumpkins in there <laughs> next for fall. All right. Another works by ABC. This is Gossamer Lace in Cross Stitch. This is number two. And this is $12. And the nice thing about these lace pieces, I'll try not to give you the glare from the light. No, it's this one. Let me see if you guys can see it okay. I want to make sure you see it. Yeah, okay. That didn't work. There you go. It was. Okay. So number two, Gossamer Lace and Cross Stitch. Number two, $12. The cool thing about these are it's done in blue. You can reverse it. You can do white on blue fabric. You can change this to any, any colors that you would like. So this is Gossamer Lace and Cross Stitch. This is number two, and this is $12. Some plastic is more glary than others. Let's see if I can make it bigger. Number three, this is How to Live, works by ABC. $8, How to Live. Number three, hopefully you guys can see these. Let me know if you, if they're too dark. I think it looks okay on my end, but you never know. Because apparently you we change when the video goes live and we get stretchy. We don't look stretchy right now. Um, but when we go to watch it, I'm like, why are we stretched out so thin? Like that never happened before. So I don't know, um, why it's doing that. So this is number three. This is how to live. I really, we really want to do an outside live. The trouble is the lighting at night. Hey, Karen. Uh, that is the issue that we're worried oh, about. And the smoke. Well, now the smoke, yeah. Know, it is. It's really bright in here. But I don't it know. is so bright in here. But for whatever reason, I guess where the lights are, um, it gets dark during the live. And we're trying. We even, look at, if, if you look into Jim's eyes, you might see the ring. We've, we've, we've even we've even gone into um, real live YouTubing technology. We have the light ring even. <laughs> so we're trying to make make it brighter here it just doesn't want to hey Kristen the light doesn't want to kind of do its thing here so we're trying that's not Kristen oh I'm sorry that's Lady Stroud Lady Stroud <laughs> <laughs> all right good luck Peggy Sunday afternoon might be nice we've never done a Sunday afternoon hmm that's something to think about all right this is another works by ABC this is elegant lace this one's so pretty this is number four, and this is $8. Elegant lace. We could do a Sunday afternoon. My dog would drive us nuts on my deck, but it'd be so pretty. Hmm. Good suggestion, Maria. We might have to make that work. Elegant lace by Works by ABC, $8, number four. Number five. This is also by Works by ABC. This is called Medieval Ornaments, $8. Number five, medieval ornaments. 
and she has some finish on the back just to give you an idea of what they look like finished. I know the colors on here are a little like more burgundy and a and a deeper kind of antique gold, but it looks like it's the metallic gold on a bright red looks beautiful. So that's number five, eight dollars, medieval ornaments. Number six, tiles of Seville in black work. $10. Tiles of Seville in black work, number six, $10. This is number six. Yeah, I then it just zooms out. Oh, I can do both. I'll do both. Go in close and then back up. So it's number six. Number seven, works by ABC, mosaic quilts. I'll start back here. Number seven, and this is $8. And then we'll go in so you can see it. I think that's what we'll do. See, to me, it looks dark, though. It's the plastic. If there was no plastic, we wouldn't have all that glare. Take each one out though. Oh, see, there, without the plastic, it works. Number seven, mosaic quilt, eight dollars. Number eight, this is heirloom lace. This one's so pretty too. This is on like a burgundy color um, that it's called actually crushed cranberries. All right, thanks, Christine. I appreciate that. So this is heirloom lace. Um, I know I have the plastic is nice, right? They're all in plastic. <laughs> Number eight, heirloom lace. This is ten dollars. This is absolutely gorgeous. Heirloom lace. Yeah, some plastic just seems to be. So much more shimmery than others. So heirloom lace, number eight, ten dollars. I love that one. So pretty. So elegant. Next up, number nine. This is called Swirling Seasons, also by Works by ABC. And this is ten dollars. Swirling Seasons, $10, number nine. Swirling Seasons. That's better, but then we're dark again. But it's okay, you're not looking at us. We're looking at the quilt. Well, I have to do, I'm out of the plastic right now, so. That's number nine, that's $10. Swirling Seasons. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Jim was talking. <laughs> I didn't even realize. All right, number 10. Let's see. This is called Evolution. $10. Let's see if that. Number 10. Evolution. $10. See, this is going to be a summer that's going to fly by for sure. I didn't even get to do my nails for like patriotic stuff. Not yet, anyway. That might be tomorrow on tomorrow's agenda. Uh, works by ABC. This is Flowers and Swirls, eight dollars. Flowers and Swirls, number eleven. Um, the one year that we went down to vacation, the house we had rented with friends had a rooftop deck. So we arrived actually on 4th of July, didn't we? That was the year mm -hmm. we arrived on 4th of July. And it was still COVID kind of uh, restrictions and stuff. So um, the they didn't have any uh, fireworks in the town. One or two towns over may have had some, but everybody was shooting them up all around us. 
So we're literally on the street, all we're, we're watching fireworks all around, which was which was pretty cool, dangerous but cool. Uh, Rosanna Dizzery, eighteen twenty, eighteen dollars. Number twelve. Let me take this one out. Too. Rosina Dizzery, I think I said that right, like Misery, Dizzery, $18, number 12. Must be nice, though, to be on the water in a boat watching the fireworks. Oh, I'd be terrified. <laughs> But because it must it, be. No, it's at night time. I know, but if you're on a big enough boat. No, would... big boats sink too. <laughs> and then I don't know which way to swim because it's too dark. Yeah, but they take longer to sink. So at least I have a chance of like getting a life jacket. and, and... <laughs> I always say, if we were meant to be in the water, we'd have fins. <laughs> I'm no fan of the water either, though. You know that. I know at the beach, I go up to my ankles at most. Maybe my calves, mid-calf, and that's about it. Uh, Color the Saurus, number 13, $8 by Works by ABC. Yeah, that's as much as, 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 as far as I go in the water. But I've done cruises. I won't, will not do a crab boat. No way, no how, unless it's a pontoon. Oh, a crab boat is easy. No, it's you, not. Because you can walk in the water. No, you can't. Yes, you, in some <laughs> areas, you can well, actually stand up. <laughs> And you no. want a fishing But the boat. second I move, the whole thing is going to topple over. You I don't move. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, next is Renaissance Band Sampler. This is $8, number 14. So this is smaller than you think it is. It's only, um, I mean, it is like 22 inches long, but it's only like three inches wide. So this is number 14, and this is $8, Renaissance Band Sampler. So pretty though. I would like to see that in like a raspberry red kind of color. I don't get me wrong, I love the bluish purple, but I'd love to see it in a red. Or even pastels, but I know that wouldn't be very renaissance -y. Next up, number 15 is Not Your Needle. This is $8. Let me see if I can show it to you. Not Your Needle, number 15, and that's $8, also by Works by ABC. And of course, we have some patriotic stuff coming up for you. We have, like I said, some closeout items. Everything is, these prices are 25% off, so this will only be $6 after the discount. Right now, that was, I tell you, the retail price. So that's number 15, Not Your Needle, $8. And if you're a club member, it's 30% off. Number 16, Alphabet Sampler. $10. Also by Works by ABC. I'll put these back in. I promise. Oh, okay. <laughs> Number 16, Alphabet Sampler. $10. Number 16. That it has been unseasonably cool, so to have some warmer days has been nice. Chase is just wanting to get in that pool, and he finally got in it twice last week or this week, I should say. So he's a happy little boy. Seasonal colors by Works by ABC. This is a fun stitch. This has like a like uh, the words or the the um, the seasons are in white lettering and then all this the seasonal colors are behind it so this is really pretty this is ten dollars number six uh number 17 seasonal colors aren't they pretty those would be cute as little pillows too for your galvanized tray in the middle of your camp or your table that was number 17 these are pretty. This is called Landscape. Let's see if you can see it without. Number 18, and that's $8. Isn't that fun? It's the same stitch, or, or not stitch, but design. But the color makes, you know, the, the, the way the colors are spread makes a beautiful landscape scene. So it's 
number 18, and that's $8. Let me just go to different. And then number 19 is called Lake, and that's also $8. Same sort of technique, a different pattern. But isn't that cute? Number 19, Lake. Haven't seen any movies recently. There's a lot that have come out, but we haven't seen any. I'm waiting for Guardians of the Galaxy to come on Disney. It still has not yet. I want to see the new Fast and the Furious because don't tell Kevin, but I love Jason Momoa. Um, sorry, Kevin. And <laughs> um, what else is out? Oh, the I want to see the one with the Star Wars guy. Oh, Indiana Jones. Yeah. Yeah, the new Indiana Jones. Oh, Kristen Stewart just said it. Indiana Jones. Good. That does look good too. Uh, there's quite a bit that's out Kristen now. Some Stewart. of them. I mean, oh, Kristen Stewart. Kristen Stewart. No, Lady Stroud. Lady Stroud. Oh my gosh, I have Twilight on the brain. Um, Brendan Fritz are on there. Is he? That's cute. Oh, hey, Amy. Um, yeah. So that I want to see that the Elementals looks cute. And if you saw the commercial for Elementals, it's a it's a um, animated Disney movie. There's a short little clip. Um, yeah, yes, you can, Kristen. <laughs> but I, but I love, I'm a Twilight mom, so I have a special place in my heart for Kristen Stroud, uh, Stewart. Oh my gosh. And you too, Kristen Stroud. I can't say either one of you right tonight. Um, what was I saying? Oh, Elementals. There's a, sh a little short w from Up and it's, uh, Mr. Fredrickson and the dog, Doug. And he says something like, you can't eat, you can't teach do uh, old dogs, new tricks, and then dog goes, I'm old? Who's doing the voice of Mr. Yeah. Doug? Because I thought he passed away. Yeah, but with all that AI technology now, they oh. can mimic his voice, and you would think that it sounded just like him. Oh. So I'm sure with their AI technology, they've mastered his voice, which is kind of scary, isn't it? Um, that, that scares me a little bit. Uh, this is Works by ABC. This is called Kindness. This is $10, number 20. Yeah, AI technology is a little, um, a little crazy for sure. I don't know what other summer movies that were supposed to be big this summer. I didn't, I don't know. But that looks great. That little short looks cute. I like he goes, you can't teach an old dog new tricks. And he goes, I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> and that dog, you know, that dog voice. It was so cute. Uh, number 21, this is Lady Evelyn's. Filet, filet lace, eight dollars. I know I I know I need to get this one. Plastic is gonna drive me nuts. Number twenty-one. Eight dollars. I think there's something else that was coming out. Uh, the Flash movie. I didn't want to see that. Not a fan of him as the Flash, um, and I'm not happy that Henry Cavill is not coming back as Superman. So that upset me. Oh, he's not. No, and he was like perfect Superman. It does, Evelyn. You're right. <laughs> this is pomegranate lace. It's a must-have. <laughs> number twenty-two. This is eight dollars. Pomegranate lace. Number twenty-two. Oh, and I think um, Disney is re-releasing a couple movies over the summer to come back into the movies, which is uh, one of them is Pirates of the Caribbean, Curse of the Black Pearl. I don't know if I ever saw any of those in the movies. I cannot remember, but I would love to get that movie feel, you know, with the sound and everything. And I, I am a huge Pirates of the Caribbean fan. Love those movies. Uh, a pincushion homage to infinite variety, three centuries of red and white quilts. Or AKA the red and white pincushion. <laughs> uh, so this is eight dollars, number twenty-three. <laughs> You're so funny, Evelyn. Um, so yeah, so that uh, that is pretty awesome because he said he will not. He adamantly said he will not come back as Jack Sparrow, which I'm sad because I love those movies. But I wouldn't mind seeing it again in the. In the theater, you. 
I don't, or, or at all. Like I'm, I've seen yeah. the movie a thousand times, so I know what happens. But just to experience it in the theater. Rosebud Lace, number 24, $8. Rosebud Lace, number 24. Isn't that pretty? So pretty. Looks like a country blue. I'm trying to see. I can't see. Oh, she dyed the color herself, so you can't buy that anymore. You have to use your own imagination. Number 25 is What Lies Within Us, $8. What Lies Within Us, number 25, $8. There was that scary movie, Boogeyman, that came out. I won't watch that. <laughs> <laughs> will not watch that. No, thank you. I used to watch scary movies. Just can't anymore. A band sampler born in 1604. $8. Number 26. Number 26. Hey, Miss Debbie. $8. All right, next up we have some patriotic for you. This is the patriotic Afghan. This is 18 count. It's red, white, and blue. And it's getting low. And it's getting they, low. They don't make that anymore. Um, yeah, so this is, I mean, it's the same as Ann Cloth, um, but it's patriotic colors, so it's called the patriotic Afghan. But they, they no longer make this. Oh, I can imagine. Hopefully, we'll see you soon. Hopefully. Uh, number 27. So, this is Patriotic Afghan. 18 count. $49.95, number 27. Now, again, that is before the discount. So, it's number 27. Patriotic Afghan. And you don't have to stitch the, an Afghan if you didn't want to. Hey, Marlene. You could stitch, cut it up into smaller squares, finish them on some mat boards. So it doesn't have to be an afghan, but this is an afghan cut. So. And it goes very well with, hey, Chris. Hey, how, so nice to see everybody on here. <laughs> it's okay, Marlene. You can join us anytime. Um, so this, th this pattern was designed for the patriotic afghan this is called american flags it's beautiful flag um motifs with all different flowers the one with the sunflowers i think might be my favorite um but this is number 28 and this is 9.95 isn't that beautiful look at the sunflowers one so you get all these pat all those patterns in here for 9.95 before the discount and that's number 28. And this, these were designed to fit into the squares of the Ann Cloth or Patriotic Afghan. Number 28. Number 29 is Luminous. I think my hair just moved. Fiber Arts, a Bluebirds Salute. $8, number 29, a bluebird salute. I don't know if that's going to come out. Number 29, $8. I think I need a pop finish on this. I think I remember what these are. Number 29. Number 30. God Bless America, Ruby, this is by Ruby Slippers Design, $14. God Bless America, this would look so pretty, I think on an opalescent. So that's number 30, and that's $14. God Bless America.
number 30. All right, number 31, we only have two of this one. This is by For My Boy, For My Boys, called Honor, Glory, Duty, Pride. It's $4.50, number 31. We only have two. Number 31, $4.50. only have two of these. Number 32, two of this one too? Mm -hmm. Oh, it is a hand. Oh, it is a Next up, number 32 is by Seekus. This is called Watercolor Stars and Stripes. This is six ninety five. Number 32. Watercolor stars and stripes. Number thirty two. Have a stitch drawing. Tula. We only have one of this guy. This is by Floss Crossing, this is called, I don't know the name. I just called it. A Spirit of America, yeah. Santa and the Elves. So Spirit of America, 995, number 33, we only have one. Number 33. Number 34, uh, Serenity in Stitching. This is a stitch in time, saves the mind. Um, well, that's what we're saying. This is red, white, and blue, Seven ninety five. I think you get all three in here, I believe. Red, white, and blue. Only have one, number 34, and that's seven ninety five. Next up, number 35 is Carolyn Manning. This is red, also called red, white, and blue. It's pretty cool how some of the blue is so deep it has that purple tone to it. This is num number 35 and is 950. Red, white, and blue by Carolyn Manning. I like her kind of quilt looking pieces. They're different. Number 35. Number 36. We only have one of this. This is by Blue Ribbon Designs. This is called Americana Panorama. So it has seven, no, eight different motifs, but they're each in little squares. And then she also turns them into little ornaments or scissor fobs or what have you. So you can deconstruct this pattern and make it into ornaments or the small pillows. So this is again, Americana Panorama. I'm gonna go close so you can see all the motifs. That's number 36. We only have one and it's $12. So more with the flash in each pattern. Tell you one second, Marianne. <laughs> it's coming up. So <laughs> number thirty-seven. Um, we have two of these. This is by Joyce Sebo. Uh, this is called Americana. And it has all different designs in here. Quite a bit actually for four ninety-five, and we only have two. So it's number thirty-seven. I'm gonna 
zoom in and I'll give you a little taste of everything that's in there. So that's number 37, 495, and we have two of these. Is that special price or regular price? That's regular, regular price. price. Okay, so that's before the 25% discount. Number 37. Number 38, Sue Hillis, the most wonderful spark, $12. Is the cat in there? I assume so. Let me look. The cat is in there. Yes, Evelyn. <laughs> Number 38, the most wonderful spark, $12 by Sue Hillis. Number 38. That's the most wonderful spark of the year. <laughs> Can't beat four ninety five, but all for all those designs plus the discount. Okay, so number thirty nine. This is called Happy Sailing. This is five ninety five. Number thirty nine. Happy Sailing, and that is patriotic pillow sham. Just in case it's the same fabric as the afghan I showed you, but it's in the pillow sham. So this is number 39 and it's $5.95. And then number 30, I'm sorry, number 40 is just called Patriotic Pillow. And again, it is the same pillow sham. So and we do have the pillow sham available. Yeah. If both in the solid red and with the flag trim, right? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Making sure before I say that, that is so true. If you wanted it, just let us know. Yep. If you wanted the pillow sham, you could just let us know. So it's number forty. Patriotic pillow, five ninety Also, uh, what was used on that patriotic afghan, if you're familiar with Dutch Treat, she uses the um, and cloth afghan and cuts it down to a three by three piece. Actually, it's four by four because you have a half of each for, fr for fringing on each side. But um, and turned them into table toppers. So these are table toppers that were made from the patriotic Afghan. So this is number 41. This is a Liberty table topper. And it shows two different options. It shows it with bright and gold uh, bells and brighter red and blue. And then there's also um, blue and deeper colors. So you'll see both of those on there, which is actually pretty cool. So this is number 41. And this is seven dollars and fifty cents. Isn't that pretty neat? Number forty-one. Number forty-two. Same thing. It's also the patriotic afghan, uh, cut into table topper size. This has two different colorways as well, and this is called July table topper. And this is six dollars and ninety-five cents. And we have the table toppers as well. Yes. Uh, we have the table toppers as well. So if you'd like to purchase a table topper, you can just put, uh, just like Carrie just did, plus the table topper. The table toppers are nineteen ninety-five. Um, that I know off the top of my head. So. <laughs> That's where you got that. No, I didn't. I was just trying to find out where that was. Where that was going. Where is it? She's up there. She's doing it okay. right behind you. That's number forty-two. July table topper. Her table toppers could be quite addictive to stitch. Um, Cause it, it's not, they're, they're not hard, but they're just so cute. And you want to start changing them for like all different uh, holidays and seasons and events and stuff. They're really cute. 
Uh, Patriot, there's another one. It's called, just called Patriotic Table Topper, number 43. This is $7.95. Patriotic Table Topper. What is that, baby? Number 43. Number 44. One more Table Topper. This is the Pledge. Seven ninety five, number forty four. Oh, you're welcome, Carol. So number forty four, the pledge. The table toppers are eighteen count, Evelyn. She likes to use watercolors, but you could use pearl cotton. It's just or just regular thread. All right, next up, RETM. This is called American Pride. This is $13.50, number 45, American Pride. Number 45, which one? Which one? Number 45, and that's one. Oh, you have one here? Number 46 is Ship's Manor. This is grand, all class. Do you want to start singing? I do. I have uh, actually <laughs> just in my head. She's a grand, all <laughs> That reminds me of grammar school. Uh, $8.50. In my head, I was going I to know. town. <laughs> I remember seeing that. <laughs> I was belting it out in my head right now. <laughs> and I'm, I can still remember all the words. And I don't remember the last time I sang it. Uh, grand old flag number 46. I'm taking it out of the plastic so you can see it better. This is $8.50 by Ship's Manor. <laughs> so you have me singing it in my head, like totally making sure I, know, I remember all the words. It's absolutely hysterical. All right, number 46. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, I can't. It totally takes me back to St. Elizabeth's in like fourth grade. You know? Game time. Oh, game time. All right. All right, we got some cute prizes. That's a slow thing. It, it's got stuck. <laughs> All right, there you go. <laughs> it's game time. So we have some prizes for you. Of course, some, most of them, not all of them, but most of them are some patriotic theme. So this, the pro winner of this uh, trivia will receive this cute little block, America the Beautiful, and the America the Beautiful towel. So let's see what trivia question I'm going to give you. This towel is really It's soft. really soft, I know. Yeah, it's like football. All right, so first person on our end to get the correct answer is going to win that cute little prize. All right, so here we go. Which American actress was ranked as the richest Hispanic female celebrity in 2010? Which American actress was ranked as the richest Hispanic female celebrity in 2010? First person to guess the correct answer. Nope, not Jennifer Lopez. It's Oh, that was a good guess. Though. That was a good guess. Because you would think it would be her. She no, has like a million things too. going. Yeah, but remember, it's 2010. I don't know if she was acting as much. She, I don't know when she started on this on the acting scene. This is not somebody that you will think it is. No, nope, not Sophia. Not Rita. Nope. It's it's not somebody that. Okay, this is gonna this is gonna mess with you guys a little bit. Um, I actually. I know the name is Hispanic, but looking at her, I did not think she was Hispanic. Not Eva, not Gloria, not Selma, not Selena. It's going to mess with you when, when you find out who it really is. They might need a clue. Um, Let's look, let me think of a clue I can give. I mean, I, I, 
Um, let me see. What clue can Come I on, get? you're not Googling fast enough. Not Gloria Estefan. Well, that's a good one, too. Yes, Kristen, Cameron Diaz. And I will show you it is my trivia question, Cameron Diaz. Yes, it is. <laughs> see, it was somebody that you would not think. You know, I'm, I knew her last name was Diaz, but I really didn't think because she's so blonde. You know, I'm like, I didn't, never really thought of her as Hispanic, but she is technically Hispanic and she is. You didn't think she was Spanish because she's blonde? No, because, <laughs> no, she just doesn't like, right, look, J-Lo, Gloria Stefan, Selena Gomez, Selena, they all have dark, beautiful, and they have dark, complex, they have beautiful Allison, Latina complexions. I know, but Paradise. I to me just because I'm visual, I just didn't see see that in her ever. And she doesn't have like they all have <laughs> accents, you know. You can hear the, the the Latin in them, right? So like I just I never I never just aside from her name. Oh, get me out of here! All right. So anyway, congratulations, Kristen. That is that one is for you. Um, it's not Kristen. It is Kristen. Lady Stroud. Oh. Congratulations. You call her Lady Stroud. I call her Kristen. Well, actually, it's Kristen. <laughs> <laughs> but I actually had a different guess as well. When I when I read that, I'm like, wow, I would not have guessed that. But I had to look at the year, too, because she was very, that was her prime. Cameron Diaz was her prime at that time. Wasn't that when um something about Mary and all, yeah. like, all that was kind of, like, coming out? I mean, she was, she was out there. So, like, she was... And she took a break from acting, you know. She stopped acting. Yeah. Now she doesn't act anymore, so we miss her. So. I see Deborah Guyton, Laura Jameson. Mm -hmm. I can't see all the names. I know. <laughs> For whatever reason, the, the it's, glare it's is hitting my glasses, <laughs> and all of a sudden I saw like I don't want to go up to the screen and squint. <laughs> I'm like, oh, I see Laura. Mm -hmm. I should hold up the mirror. Mm -hmm. And we see Laura. And we see <laughs> <laughs> now Sophia Figara. She look. I mean, I know J Lo looks absolutely amazing, but yeah. Sophia is stunning. She is just so stunning. She actually cracks me up because when she's on America's Got Talent, I want her to do some of the stuff she does on Modern Family. And they were doing something one day, and, and you know that one episode was just J J J. She keeps saying J, and they think she sounds like the car alarm outside. They they had a skit on America's Got Talent, and I wanted her to bust into character, and she <laughs> didn't. I was so, I was so disappointed. Um, but she's she is absolutely beautiful. I wish I had that that beautiful that the beautiful skin tone. I have I I have freckles. I burn and then I freckle. Not but that that's it's what makes me. you you. Is that the law firm that's back there? Yes. Um. I oh know. yeah, I do that. Star Spangled Welcome. Forever in my heart. This is stitched on banding. Oh. Um. I like that leather. <laughs> Thank you. It's very long. <laughs> it is very long. Um, but this, what count is this? This is 24 count. It's a 24 count banding. Patriotic banding. And we do have the, you know, I forgot to pull it out. But we do have this banding as well. If you're interested. So this is number 47 and this is 795. It comes with that red and blue already, already woven in. This is already woven in the you just have to do all the stitching. <laughs> so if you want to just say band, please. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Kristen, we have the banding too. <laughs> so number 47, star, she, you, you read Lady Kristen's mind. It's not Lady Kristen, now. Lady Stroud. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, you're the one that needs to call her that. I don't call her that. All right. Let's see. Number 48, Forever in My Heart, Forever Freedom, 695. Hey, you. <laughs> what do they say? As long as you don't call me late for dinner. I hope moving and everything went well, Kristen. It's crazy. It's like you move them in, you move them out, you move them in. So hopefully all is good. We move Shane in next week um, for his internship back up to campus he's there for the whole month of july he is going to be an not counselor but he's going to be per, doing the stage managing for their production i believe that they're putting on it's like a, it's a camp for them 
I guess he's a counselor. And then they also sleep over for the three weeks. So he's kind of like a, an RA too, which is kind of funny. All right, Marianne, this is the chart that goes with that pillow sham behind the gym. This is called God Bless America. This actually comes with the uh, the pattern and then another pattern for a belt for a bell pull or wall hanging. Um, again, patriotic. This we don't have shams that are like this, um, but you can get a pillow sham. Of, uh, or in, if you just want a cut of the fabric, and you could finish it. We do have those. So you could just say, and fabric cut. They're four ninety five. For a, It's just a pillow cut. It's not a finished pillow sham. You would have to finish it all yourself. It's just the pattern. You can just take it. Okay. So number 49, and that's seven ninety five. Aww. And his winter coat. Gosh. Tears. Was there, were there tears? It fit on the, yeah, the, the, it, absolutely. It's the same. The stitching area is all the same, Marianne. It's just the ruffle that is different. Um, the, it's the same exact fabric. So number 49. So this is just what a pillow cuts would be. Again, there's no finishing. That's the toe. It, you'd have to finish it all on your own. And then we do have, for what you're showing here, the banners, which is hanging on the window. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the banner's on the window. So, so I'll sign those numbers. <laughs> so if you, the one I just showed you that says God Bless America has the pillow plus the wall hanging. Um, This is Grand Old Flag, which ha is the Old Glory pillow sham. And I don't see this wall, this hanging. I don't, I don't know if you were able to see. Which one? Is old I'm gonna, Glory. You can do Old Glory. That's going to be in this next pattern. And you know, I didn't realize you had this this, this flag that you saw last time I came here. Oh, yeah. So this is Grand Old Flag. This is six ninety five, and that's number 50. So this is, no. Kristen, I don't know what the wall hanging is in the one that it's up there. They're not quite the same. That one is I Love America. This was God Bless America, Home I Sweet Home. That. That was number 49. This is Grand Old Flag, number 50. Okay, just let me know, Marianne, so I make sure I bring it with me. <laughs> sorry, I was being nosy as what you were doing. <laughs> no, it got I know, sorry. <laughs> number 50. And then number 51, this is also Patriotic Pillow Shams. Um, or pillow design, it's called Patriotic Pillows, but it's on the Ann Cloth um, Pillow Sham. So this is six ninety five, or the Patriotic Pillow Sham. I keep saying it. Okay, that's number 51. Next up is also by Dutch Treat. Okay. Oh, good. Um, yay. This is called Long May It Wave. What do we got? Yay. Oh, Kristen. Because gonna... I can't see it. Oh, <laughs> Kristen's going to come. I feel so left <laughs> out. <laughs> I don't know why you can't see it. I can see it, it fine. I think it's reflecting off my glasses. Oh. So, like, the haze it's... outside is what I see in here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the... Kristen might be coming on the eighth. That's oh, awesome. Cool. The fun, the cool thing, well, the weird thing about Stewartsville, I had to run to the store after we set up, and I'm driving up a hill, and it's, it's like nothing. There was like nothing. It was all like not. Oh, it looked like we were in Kansas. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and then all of a sudden, boom! There's a town. It was. It was. It's really cute. It's very. It's very country, but it's a very very cute area. Um. It was actually very serene. I was just like, yeah, oh, you know. All right, so well, I'm looking forward to seeing you. Long may it wave. This is by Dutch Treat. Eight dollars, number fifty-two. Long may it wave. But I will forewarn you that hill goes from 
like 45 to 25 and there was a cop waiting right at the end. <laughs> anyway, I'm, just, I'm like, oh, he must get a lot of people there. Number 53, this is America the Beautiful, $7.95. This is stitched on fabric or Af an afghan. Number 53. You, uh, Grandma Kate, she used to call them afghans. Afghans? Afghans. <laughs> and I used to tell her it's afghan. She added an extra A. a. There. She goes, I love making afghans. <laughs> <laughs> That's again, number 53. Is that gorgeous? That's seven ninety five. dollars That's again. Yeah. I got my that grandma my used to crochet a lot, so she would constantly be making new Afghans. <laughs> <laughs> um, Cross Stitch Wonders. This is Subway Art, 4th of July. Six pickups, number 54, and this is ten fifty. Subway Art, 4th of July. I got the hiccups. Number 57. So it's nice having the 4th of July on a Tuesday. Hopefully everybody's got a four-day weekend. That's a long weekend. And if you don't, then give me the number of your bosses. I will call them because I am a therapist for needlework. So I will write you a prescription to get off from work. <laughs> All right, Debbie. Hopefully they have bingo this time and it's in there. Oh, you can stay for bingo. Um, Who said that? I, no. Oh, Debbie. Debbie. Debbie okay. Gunn, yeah. I, don't I forgot you can't see. <laughs> um, they, uh, a lot of places though you have to work the day before and the day after they don't they won't close on that monday it's kind of, that kind of stinks or it could have been <coughs> i think you're not feeling well <laughs> <laughs> then you still won't get paid for the holiday i think you have to plan that ahead of time oh hey karen how are you all right karen so English? there you go see <laughs> <laughs> um this is who is this sue, sue hillis, hillis. An American's Pledge. There's a big add-on in here. This is a big, this is a big book. Um, $12, number 55. Oh, yay! Hopefully you stay for bingo, too. I think we're going to have, like, a whole room to a, full of bingo people. <laughs> You're not feeling well that day, right, Chris? Oh, okay. So... That's not bad. I would take every Friday off versus just the one day for sure. Too loudly. Yeah, I guess not. <laughs> just quietly. <laughs> Golf ball. <laughs> All right. The um this is by Northern Expressions Needlework. This is the star this is Star Spangled Banner. Um there is only one and this is fifteen fifty. <coughs> yeah, I feel a little something coming on. <laughs> We're already off four days. I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now she's isn't going, it cute, Carol? She's going for the whole week. <laughs> well, I do have to move Shane in on the 6th, which is the day after, but that's only an hour. It is from the smoke. <clears throat> Kristen, <clears throat> no. <laughs> we haven't had a four-day weekend, and I don't know how long. <laughs> so <laughs> This is number 56, Northern Expressions Need to Work, Star Spangled. Isn't that pretty? I picture that on like a French vanilla swirl. Because it has that kind of over dyed. Yeah. <laughs> You're being legal this time. Chris, when you see us again, you got to give us the name of those restaurants again in Red Bank. I can't remember them. Or message me. I can't remember you guys. The one pizza place well, that you guys are talking about. We saw the one. We saw the Yeah, brothers. but the other one I think is the other way. The yeah. one where you said they have like huge pies. We want to get it the next time we're down there. Oh, and if anybody watching that came out to Red Bank, thank you. Yes. I, I could not believe how many people came to sit and stitch. Yes, it was uh, very nice. It was nice to see all the tables filling up. Uh, reminds me of when we go to Bridgewater. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was really nice. Yes, thank you, Chris. Uh, Threadwork Primitives. This is American Eagle. We have two of these, nine ninety five. Oh, the view. Look at the view. 
with two of these, number 57, 995. Well, and now we know when we go to Red Bank, we can get lunch. Yes, we, we can actually get lunch and then sit down in the garden area the by one. the water. Yeah, so we didn't even know that, you know, um, the kitchen is open from 11 to 3 and we can order lunch. So we are super excited about that for the next time we go down there. Because we all know about the lunch in, at Bridgewater. In Bridgewater. You know that's oh my God. yeah, but yeah, but Bridgewater has has held us. They're up here, you know. They 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 have, we have high standards now when it comes yeah. to the food because their food is really good. All right, so this is the um, if you already commented that you want the pillow cut, I think Carrie did. It's fine. You don't have to comment with the number. We'll um, we'll fill it in. We'll for fill you. it in. But this is the pillow cut. So this is number fifty eight. This is again just a pillow cut, and is four ninety five. So you could finish it. However you want, with a simple edge, roughly, use it as a frame piece. Yeah, whatever you want. So that's number 58, and that was 495. That's the Patriotic Afghan Pillow Cut. All right, and then this is the banner. So this is actually three squares, yeah. three full stitching squares, and plus a half of Half a square all the way so around that, for finishing. These that Allison had showed oh, you. Oh, there. That's the that's one. That's the one that's coming the, up. That's but, the one. In the, but that is the cut to make these. That banner that's hanging back there. There's actually three, three of them. I okay. Think, that we showed. So this is six ninety five, and this is number fifty nine. That's the one, Chris Giuseppe's. That's the one. Oh. That's the one that's like fifteen minutes away. But we have we have to go to that one. I wanted to get that. One. They have pizza deals too. Two pizzas for twenty bucks. I think she said. Oh, I was gonna say what's a pizza. <laughs> Two pizza for oh, twenty bucks. A special pricing. Oh. <laughs> Patriotic banner, eighteen count, six ninety five, number fifty nine. All right, number sixty, and this is the belt. This is the wall hanging that's on the window. This is I Love America, number sixty, and that's six ninety five. And there's another pillow sham in there too. The U.S. one. Number sixty. Oh, two huge pies for twenty two dollars. Oh, it's okay. I don't need any toppings as long as it's a good pizza with good sauce and good seasoning. It has to have good seasoning because the pizzas by us they don't put anything. It's cheese and sauce. I like oregano. I like Italian seasoning. Just a little something on the pizza, just to give it a little something more. You know what I do like? What's the pizza put the other pizza place? Anthony's Stone Fryer. Oh, the stone, stone cold, stone, stone, stone cold. A hot one. <laughs> I know, but they have it's Pete. It's like a caprese one, but it's whole sliced tomatoes and a little bit of cheese. But oh, it's just so good with topped with Parmesan cheese. Oh, it's delicious. No, I want that. Can't be hungry. We're always hungry when we do the pizza line. We're always hungry, <laughs> and we eat late. <laughs> we have to eat before. Old Glory. We only have one of these, number 61, and that's $3.50. Coal-fired pizza. It's really good. They're very expensive. So that's number 61. I knew what you meant, Mary. <laughs> They're really good, though. They're, I can't remember what it was called. It was tomato and, I guess, I guess Caprice. $3.50. Only have one, number 61. Number 62, this is Fancy That. This is Hat of the Month, and this is July. We have only have three of these, $6.95. Hat of the Month, number 62, three months. You know, I, I fall down rabbit holes on Instagram very easily, but there's a new way to decorate. Oh, I thought you were going to say you fell. Oh, no. So like, there's a new way to decorate cakes, um, like cartoonish. Like you decorate the cake and then you outline it all like in black, and it looks like it's a cartoon. Oh, really? It's the coolest thing. I want to take cake and stick and pop. Oh, I couldn't. I'd be eating the icing well, that all day. Too, but... <laughs> Every time I made a mistake, I'd be eating it all. Cat of the month. <laughs> yeah, it didn't look like a cat. No, I really do. I want to learn how to do all that. So I, I would, I would have so much fun with that. I'll, I'll eat what you okay. make. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tempting tangles. This is We Are One, fourteen ninety five, number sixty three. See, I'd rather cook than bake. 
Well, no, 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 because baking is just too precise. That's why I like it. No. I can't screw it I, up. I know, because <laughs> with cooking, at least you can make it your own. You can wing it. You can't substitute it in well, a way with no, baking. No, but that's okay. I don't want to. I, I have a recipe. It tells me exactly what I have to do, and then that's it. I don't like being adventurous with cooking. I don't like it. Oh, I love that. Mm -mm. Oh, me. that's the picture I have. Oh, okay. So this is called Liberty Angel. We only have two of her. I actually think that that is just, well, it's leisure art. So yeah, it's discontinued. Isn't this beautiful? That we only have two. And they're only $2.50 before the 25% off. Hello. I can't get a mirabilia. But that is gorgeous. <laughs> I love that. So it's number 64. We only have two. And I didn't even know that we still had two copies of Arugula. I just keep it because I like the design. Number 64. Only have two. But you got it, Miss Pam. Beautiful. I love her wings. That's it. 64. Ah, oh, 64 is sold out. Sorry, Debbie. <laughs> um, My Big Toe, America the Beautiful, seven ninety five. I'm going to start sticking this one, too. Oh. <laughs> no, I feel like Now it's going to be in my head. No. The other one is is a good one. That was a fun, fun one. Number 65. I'll, and I'll you, see it down to the second one. And if you see behind me the, the little gnome, that's the gnome that travels when we go to shows. The one hanging. Yeah, my little nephew made that because he couldn't come to one of the shows. So I take that with me when I travel. So he's right next to that blue picture of Madonna. That's actually numbered. Did you notice that? The Madonna? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, they only mm -hmm. made, now I can't remember. Like 2,500, I think. They, they made 15,000 copies. Oh, that many? But I, I thought it was less. But I copy number 4,019. Okay. Isn't that pretty cool? <laughs> <laughs> But I love that picture of her. <laughs> Next up is Seekus, a patriotic heart, number 66, 595. I like the blue in the picture, though. Yeah. The, the, not that well, she it's the blue pretty. and the black. Yeah, the combination. I love how that looks. I actually want to do an overdye with like an aqua blue and then some black going to it. No, but that has yellow in it. Okay. There's a few other colors. Okay. I think I'll pop up the star. Number 67, this is Watercolor, 4th of July by Seekus, $6.95. Number 67. Chris wants to know if you sent her flowers when she was in the hospital. LOL. No, I cried. <laughs> I actually did cry. Because <laughs> I'm like, she has to be okay. <laughs> I can't handle it if she wasn't. <laughs> For me, she's like a family member. <laughs> But I will be honest, when I was in my teens, I did send Christmas cards, Easter cards, you Valentine's Day cards. Yeah. I did not know that. I, did. I don't know where they ended up, you know. Well, everybody they sends fan yeah. mail. Everything is yeah, fan so, mail. Yes, I did. But no, I just sent her lots of prayers. Yeah. Well, we wish her well. And I had my tears. Uh, this is Seekus and Company Red, White, and Blue Needle Roll and Mini, mini Sampler, 695, number 68. And whoever laughed, I heard you. <laughs> <laughs> I get sucked down all those rabbit holes, and it, like people have all these conspiracy theories. Michael Jackson is still alive, this and that. So, God forbid. Something. Allison. No, I'm saying like eventually, when she's like a hundred, yeah, then there'll still be conspiracy theories that she's alive. Elvis is still alive. Yes. I'm going to live to 100. She will still be here. She can go when I go. Okay. <laughs> Patriotic Hearts and Sampler Stitches, 695, number 69. Number 69. Patriotic Hearts and Sampler Stitches. But that's the trouble like with the internet. It just takes you down these dark places <laughs> and then you start thinking about things you're like hmm could that be true could that be true i 
No, it's not. But your mind starts wondering. So. All right. Seekers and Company Patriotic Square, six dollars and ninety-five cents. Number seventy. And me and Reba were talking about. There's these videos that pop up. And they're washing rugs. Have you ever seen these videos on Instagram? I don't know where they find these rugs. They have to be like in a flood or I don't know if they purposely like dump just mud on these rugs over and over and over again. But you just watch them clean these rugs and you're trying to guess what color the rug is before <laughs> they can get it clean. I don't know what the fascination is about seeing somebody clean a rug. <laughs> I don't remember how it goes on. No children. I smell children. No, now this is I smell game. <laughs> he smells a game. All right. All right. We have another patriotic prize for you. Uh, you will get this let's towel. Let's see. And it says USA. This is really cute. I it love how cute. it's tied I love together. this little wooden. See, Elaine? I'm not the only one that loves rug videos. You get hooked. Do you like that? Elaine. You okay. like to see what color it's going to be at the end. All right, so let's see what what so um, towel and question I'm going to ask. This is you. heavy. It is. They're cute though. See these look so cute. Those like little trays. All right. Here we go. First person to guess the correct answer is going to win this cute little prize. Good luck. Which top American actor's middle name is Leroy? There may be more than one answer, but I only have one answer. Leroy. Do you have a song that comes to your head when you hear that word, that name? No, but don't put one. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say it after. Which top American actor's middle name is Leroy? Dad, Dad, oh, God, Leroy that's Brown. Not, that is not Tom Hanks. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> now it's in my head. Now it's in your head. Not Tommy Lee Jones. Samuel... L. Jackson. That's right, Debbie. Who got it right? Debbie Guy is Sam Samuel Jackson. So the L is for Leroy. Debbie, so congratulations, for Debbie. Congratulations. Uh, on our end, Debbie got up there first. So congratulations. Sorry, Carrie. You were right after her, like, seconds. But it is Samuel Jackson. Samuel L. Jackson for Leroy. Debbie so, G. Debbie G. <laughs> okay, I did not know that, but now you're going to have bad, bad Leroy Brown stuff in your head. Bad, bad. Leroy Brown. It's sad that I, I can't know. move too much. My thingalings. <laughs> Mine doesn't move. My, My thingalings do move. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> but yes, it was. That was easy. That was too easy. Let me see if there's another. Just for pride. Not prize. Nah, those are boring. Nope, those are boring. Never mind. Here, for pride, not prize. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? <laughs> What's the question on here? Who li oh, good boy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. All right. Patriotic Log Cabin Quilt Square by Seekus, number 71, 695. SpongeBob SquarePants. SpongeBob is on all the time in my house. It's so funny because you know Shane is 21 years old. Chase is seven, but Spongebob was Shane's first birthday theme. He loved the song, and they still air this cartoon more than they air anything else on Nickelodeon. It's on all the time. Yeah. So it's amazing, and they still have new episodes, even though I've seen you know, most of them a thousand times. Actually, I'll tell you a quick funny story. The other night we were watching Spongebob. I think it was a Spongebob movie. And they sing a Goofy Goober song, but it's called Goofy Goober Rock. And it's set to the, to the music of I Want to Rock by Twisted Sister. So Chase is singing it. I said, do you? And we just saw Rock of Ages at um, the plays in the park. And they sing that song in there. And I said, Shane, uh, Chase, I said, that's, you want to hear the original song? I said, that's a real song that they... And he's like, yeah, so he's, you know, doing his little rocking thing. It was so cute. It's not funny, but it was a cute story. It is. Yeah, but like my Catholic school. Like, was. Yeah. When I was in Catholic school, we had to make up a song to go with. I don't know what the nun was trying to get us to do, but we had to take a song and turn it into something of our own. Well, I, I had a thing for Joan Jett. 
back then. And I there was that one song, I love rock and roll. Well, I went to St. Adalbert's. It was a Catholic school. So mine was, I got up in front of the class and I was, I love St. Adalbert's. Yeah. Well, the nun just did not like that. She had no, you know, and I was, put another dime in the mission box. And I even did the, yeah. And she was so angry that I was singing a rock song. And I'm in a Catholic school. I'm like, okay, it's Joan Jett. It's not. I know. <laughs> was but, it like it was sacrilegious? Yeah, but they, well, I tell you, we used to have a talent show and my friend wanted to do a dance to Straight Up by Paul Abdul. She was banned. She wasn't allowed to do it. Oh. I mean, because I had innuendos that we as young kids had no idea what it meant, but the teacher made us. But I don't know what was wrong with Jonah Jets. I love rock and roll. Well, I, but I figure because I added in I love Santa Alberts, that would make it okay. <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> Patriotic Afghan by Sikis, number 72695. Oh, oh, that would have went over well, Kristen. <laughs> They should have sang a Black Sabbath song. <laughs> <laughs> um, anywho, so go just reverting back to that. If you guys, uh, Patriotic Afghan six ninety five number seventy two. If you're from around the Edison area, they do wonderful plays in the park productions. We they just finished Rock of Ages, which ended last week. The next um, show is Ain't Misbehaving, and that'll be next week. I think that starts and that runs for two weeks. Which is pretty, and they these are outdoor productions. They're on an outdoor stage, but they are awesome. They do some. There's so much hard work that they put into these, but they really do nice productions. So if you're in the area, I'm looking some, forward to seeing Ain't Misbehaving because yeah. I've never seen that. I've never seen it either. And then what was the last one? Oh, Cinderella. Cinderella. And I love Cinderella. I, I mean, it's it's the Rogers. Isn't it Rogers and Hammerstein? Yeah. It's there. It's that version. Yeah. I'm obsessed with the latest version with uh, Kate. Blanchett. Blanchett. Yeah. Um, that one is really good. Yeah, I like that one too. I, I watched it last week. But Ever After is still our favorite. Yes. Ever but they After. don't air it anymore. You can watch it on Disney Plus. I've watched it on oh, Disney Plus. Okay. Uh, Let Freedom Ring Drum. This is by Danes of the Needle. So this is number 73. We only have two. Oh, did you? It was good. Okay, so I have another funny story for you, Maria, and everybody. Um, I'll try not to use any curse words. But Chase was with us watching it. And I've seen the movie. I've never seen the play. And I didn't realize how much cussing there was in there. But he had his headphones on and he was playing on my phone. You know, I didn't really think he was hearing too much. And he didn't really know that they were bad words anyway. Well, they're, at one point they say the F word one time. And I didn't know. I didn't know that that was coming up or going to happen. Of course, Chase hears it. And what does he say? Mom, that is the worst word ever. He needs to be arrested. <laughs> I said, okay, we'll, we'll get it. We'll arrest him. <laughs> I was like, I didn't know that they were going to say that. I mean, I don't, I never saw it. I'm like, they didn't put a disclaimer that there was like bad language. I'm like, oh my gosh. <laughs> so anywho, but that was, it was funny though. Yeah, it was. Yeah. So and but then Chase, I'm like, Chase was getting arrested. Yes, but then I'm like, how do you know that's the worst word ever? You know, so that's going through my head. All right, we have some fabric for you. This is Belfast 32 Count Light Amsterdam Blue. Let's see how this light, oh, this light looks, makes the fat colors better. Better. I've seen the movie, Marie, and I don't remember the language being in the movie. Yeah, so this light makes the picture, the colors, like, true, true to color. So this is number 74, and this is 18.95 for a quarter yard. Before the discount. Before your discount. So Belfast, 32 Kent Linen, Light Amsterdam Blue. But we are looking forward to Ain't Misbehaving. Again, they do great productions. If you're not familiar with it, look it up on Facebook. Look it up online. It's $8 a ticket. Uh, children are free. Senior citizens are $5, I think, a ticket. And you put your chair down. You bring your own chair. They tell you where, you know, there's rows for you to put them in. They're very strict about that. And you put them down and you can leave, go get dinner, and then come back. It's, and it's a night out. It's a That's beautiful show. if you're in New Jersey and if, if you're in if. the Edison area. <laughs> Big ifs. But there might be something in your area, something to look into. 
Uh, this is Belfast 32 count. This is dark chocolate. Number 75. These are quarter yard cuts. This is a true brown. Let's look at the pink one. 1895 for an 18 by 27 inch piece. Number Something 75. With pink and cream. Yeah. Reminds me of those cookies. We love seeing those plays. Last year we saw SpongeBob the musical. Um, like I said, they just they do wonderful performances. Mary Poppins. Mary Poppins actually, the very last like half hour or forty five minutes, it started to rain. So the orchestra had to stop playing, but they still sang uh, the the songs without music. It was so such talent there was. Uh, Belfast thirty two count Christmas red. Number 76, 1895 for a quarter yard. This would look really nice on those uh, medieval ornaments from uh, works by ABC that I showed in the very beginning. Number 76. So I've seen the movie with, and Maria, you, you'll know because it, they referenced um, the movie at the end that Tom Cruise was in it. It was okay. You know, I liked hearing the songs, though. You got to hear the songs longer in the movie than in the performance. Belfast 32 Count Spring Green. This is a beautiful light green. See, this, this light is nice because it really shows the color perfectly. It doesn't alter it. Nice light but bright spring green. So this is number 77, and this is 1895 for a quarter yard. And they have a snack bar, though, there. You can get food there. They have, I mean, of course, Italian ice, pretzels, cotton candy, nachos. But they even have, like, a Caesar salad. They have some wraps. We ordered pizza from Menlo Pizzeria and brought it I over. I eat the whole time we're there. We do. We bring a cooler. I'm, and we have chips. I'm nonstop eating. Twizzlers. That's why I have to work all the popcorn. time. Because if I'm just sitting, <laughs> they eat. <laughs> we eat a lot. Uh, Belfast 32 count deep magenta. Deep magenta. 1895 for a quarter yard. But it's a nice night out. And the play was two and a half hours. So where else can you go for eight bucks a ticket to see a show? And I don't know. Parking is free. <laughs> That's another added plus. All right, 79 Belfast Linen. This is navy. Isn't that pretty? Magenta is pretty. This is Belfast Navy, number 79. I think last time we did our linen talk, we showed a lot of the sampler colors and the basics. Um, but a lot of stitchers don't realize that there are these bright colors or deep In the regular colors. line. It's not just... Right. Um, it's not just in the over dyes. There are... You know, there's... Over the years, I know we talked about how many colors have come and gone. Yeah. Um, um, but, oh, you want hints, Carol? Hmm. We can give hints. Oh, for uh, PA? Yeah. Yeah. So we have some classes by Susan Greening. Susan Greening Davis will be doing two regular classes, and then she has four additional, what she likes to call, make it and take it. And they're really cute. reasonably priced and you get all the materials and I think they're all under $25. And they're done. You make it and then you're yeah. done. You sit there for probably even an hour and then you're done, but they're really cute. And then we have some hard anger classes with Miss Carol. Yeah. We have She's two. Here. Um, and one of them is really cool. We've done it in the shop. It was a sachet bag. Mm -hmm. um, so if you've never done hard anger before and you feel intimidated by it, Carol makes it look so easy. And I will say the last time we had it was a, almost, I think, all beginners. Yeah. Everybody finished their project, their little bag. Mm -hmm. So um, it was really cool. And then there's one that probably takes it a step further. So if you're there and you want to take the class, we have the photos coming out. Yeah, so we're working on all those flyers. So those, I know, I, I knew mean, they did, Kristen. In the next couple of days. Yeah, well. after the holiday, we'll probably be sending out... Um, information on yeah. on the classes so and, yes and then there's three classes from maureen one of them is going to be on the, the heart's content from the heart's content uh, 
stitch band to make bell poles. Then there's one to make little, I don't know if you want to turn them into, but like little pillows or something. But they're mm -hmm. really cute projects. So we wanted to keep them more simple uh, so that you would, you know, enjoy and actually get them done. Yeah. Not something that's going to take you a year. I don't think it's the same class that we offered in the store. Which one? The Hardanger. The... The so Debbie had signed up, but I think it was a different. That's a different. That was the green yeah. one, right? That one was an advanced hard anger. So yeah. Carol and I still have to uh, talk about how to make that one happen. Um, yeah, but that's it right now. Um, mm -hmm. We have some trunk shows coming to us from people who couldn't make it. Like we were hoping to have Michelle, and she wasn't uh, with Stitching Pretty for some silver, but she wasn't able to make it that weekend. So she has a trunk show coming. She's uh, Sister Lou. She'll be there with her trunk show. Noteworthy Needle. She's sending a trunk show. So, so this is and there's a free lecture. Too. Oh yeah, Susan's doing a free lecture. Yes. So lots of things, lots of surprises coming. Belfast 32 count linen. And this that's a, a brand new color. Brand new color. This is called Orchid. I don't think it's the same class, Debbie, but we we can talk when we see you. Number 80. 1895 for 18 by 27 inch piece. This is orchid. Brand new color. Yeah, the one that we had hanging in the store was the green. <laughs> yeah, for and that green. was going to be a two parter class. Oops. Brand new color. Orchid. Number 80. 1895. Next up is this is a very popular. Um, Fabric. This is the dots, the Belfast 32 count linen dots. This is, it's like an antique blue. Aw, yay, Carol. I'm so excited. We're going to have such a great time. This is my first time, too. I'm, I'm a newbie to the PA retreat, so I'm looking forward to it. But listen, you people out there, no bribe and shame for the answers to the trivia questions. He ain't going to give them to you. Maybe for the right price. I don't know. <laughs> Number 81 is Belfast white and antique blue dots. So for a quarter yard, this is 1995. I'm so looking forward to it. Number 81. 18 by 27 inch piece. And it's not too far. I like that. <laughs> it's not that far away. Far and, enough. And if you're not attending the event, but you're in the area and want to stop by, come in, say hello, mm -hmm. shop. Yeah, and all the designers will also be having their, they'll be vending as well. So you can shop with the designers that we have there. Like I said, we have some trunk shows. Next up, who doesn't love country mocha? Belfast 32 count country mocha. Number 82, 1995, before the discount for an 18 by 27 inch piece. A lot of favorites, country mocha. This is a staple of most people's stash. If you do any of the New York Dreamers, any of her um, rolling pin designs, this is what she uses, just to let you know. Number 83, Belfast Blue Whisper, another vintage Blue Whisper. Number 83, 1995, for a quarter yard, 18 by 27 inch piece. Number 83, Blue Whisper. This is the vintage where it's only printed on one side. You know what I find very inter interesting? What base fabric is this? Little Boy Blue. Yeah. But they don't make Little Boy Blue. No. How how interesting is that? So the ba the cut what they use to make this fabric is called for an, a color that they don't make anymore, which is Little Boy Blue. But it is Little Boy Blue. <laughs> Number eighty three. All right. Here's another new one. This this was available in Lugana thirty two count, right? First. First. So this is what we call splash. So it looks like or splatter kind of looks like paint splatter a little bit. Um, this is Belfast 32 count. This is pink with white. 
this is what they call splash number 84 also 1995 this is brand new to the line as well i was at one of the shows and <laughs> one, one of the stitchers came up and said i love these splashes that you do uh -uh. i'm really into halloween um could you make one look like blood uh -uh. <laughs> and i'm like Oh, well, that's different. <laughs> <laughs> we could. You know, it's not impossible. We could do it. All right. Next up, we have some specials for you. So these are... Um, that's the Largo. This is the Largo Table Topper. These are discounted at 50% off. So these are already special price. There's no further discounts to apply. And if you purchase the Largo, you will get this design free. So this is firecracker, firecracker, boom, boom, boom. I, <laughs> I love this one. So if you put it on your table and you're sitting it like this, it won't block your stitching. So this is what we call Largo. So this is in the color eggshell. And this is $19.95. Normally $39.95. This is $19.95, number 85. So you get the table topper with a free pattern, number 85, Largo Table Topper, special price, only $19.95. And that's 50% off. If you've stitched one of these already, you know how much fun they are. The pattern does repeat all the way around. So, um, you know, I think it's in each corner, so to speak, or, and it's easy enough to do. And it's nice to change up your home decor for all the different holidays. Those are a lot of fun. So that's number 85. Number 86 is also a specially discounted um, at, uh, table topper. This is Stella. Stella, Stella. And this <laughs> one, you only stitch in the center. So you would get the eagle one. So you would get this pattern to stitch on this table topper. So this is... Also $19.95, normally $39.95, and this, this comes in white. white. So this is number 86, Stella. I know it shows red, but you get the white table topper. Number 86, you get the pre-eagle pattern with it. Special price of $19.95. Stella. It makes me think of Modern Family, not... Yes. Because <laughs> the dog's name was Stella, and he... They lose them, so Cam is out there Stella, doing the whole crying <laughs> thing. <laughs> and then Mitchell calls, and he's like, you'd be so proud of me. <laughs> All right. These are um, these are more designs that will go with the patriotic afghan or pillow shams. This is by um, Kind Stitchworks. This is called United We Stand. This is number 87. Which one is the firecracker? That's for the Largo table topper, Marianne. And that was number... Number 85. So this is number 87. This is 595. United We Stand. Number 87. Do you remember that cheer? Firecracker, firecracker. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. But there was a dance, too. There was a dance? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I remember the cheer. Well, it couldn't be anything. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so number 87, 595. Yeah, like hands on your hips and <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom, boom. <laughs> also by Kind Stitch Works, this is United States Capital, also five ninety five. Number eighty eight, United States Capital. You get a little silly over here. Number eighty eight. Number 89, also kind stitch works. This is the White House and the National Christmas Tree. Also 595. Number 89. The Christmas tree is actually really nice. Number 89. All right, sweet wing. Really? <laughs> I purposely ordered them. <laughs> that wascally wabbit is back. <laughs> <laughs> sweet, 
sweet wing. I cannot say this without like that emphasis. Sweet wing studio forever in peace. This is pretty too. So it's eight dollars. Sweet. I'm just gonna say forever in peace. Number ninety. This is number ninety. Eight dollars. Forever in peace. Oh, Jim, you're going to get it. Number 91, Sweet Wing Studio, A Little Summer. Isn't that cute? It is really cute. As soon as I saw that, I'm like, oh, my God, that's adorable. It is really cute. It's just a whole bunch of littles. That's all yeah. it is. All the designs are just littles. So that's number 91, Sweet Wing Studio, A Little Summer. And it's just all little summer. Number 91. Number 92. Always time for tea. By so what company? It's by Sweet Wing Studio. I had to really think about saying it that I don't do that. Oh, it's always time for tea. Number 92, $7. I have to make a conscious effort when I say the name of that company. Number 92. Always time for tea. Number 93. This is uh, number four in this series. <coughs> this is by Cottage Garden. This is called the Snowman Collector Series. So this is number four, and this is the Postman. The postman number 93 and it's ten dollars so this is the number four in the series the postman ten dollars i have another song that just popped in my head yeah i have it <laughs> it came over i don't know what's all the music <laughs> uh this is number five in that same series by cottage garden and this is the scarecrow Ten dollars, number ninety-four. Oh, here's another story for you. Another chase story. I may have told you on the last one, but uh, this is how the progress is going. So Chase decided he he picked seeds from the store and he wanted to plant tomatoes, carrots, and corn. Um, but he dumped all the seeds into a pot. <laughs> So the corn has started to grow. and Which, which he thought was carrots. <laughs> what he thought was the carrots. It turned out to be the corn. Um, and there's just a bunch of corn all in one little spot. I do not know how this is going to happen. So I have to figure out once they grow a little bit to see if I can move them. I don't know if that's going to do anything. I have no idea. But if you see this kid, this <laughs> little face, he is so proud. He, We go well, outside to look at them. And he seriously looks at me and says, Jim, in 65 days, I'll be able to harvest. Because he read the packet now, and said. He has them in these little pots, but <laughs> he'll be harvesting his vegetables. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm afraid of how they're going to grow. Or the squirrels might have a feast. Who knows? Um, also in the same snowman collector series, Cottage Garden, this is the Gardener, number 95. And this is $10. Number 95. Ten dollars, the gardener. Yeah, so I have to see because they, the sprouts are about four inches tall now. So I have to figure out if I can move them. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. It's a cluster of corn. <laughs> it's gonna grow so well. Oh. Yeah, I've never tried corn, so I have no idea. Maybe since they're all gathered together. Well, his <laughs> corn is grown. <laughs> um, and this is number seven in the series. This is the Coachman, and that's $10. Number 96, the Coachman. Number 97. The carrots are just starting to sprout, but I remember growing carrots as a kid, but I think they're mini carrots, so we may be okay in the pot. Uh, tomatoes, we're just going to have a whole lot of tomatoes. I don't even know what's going to happen with those. I might be able to, once they get bigger, replant them. Right now, they're the tiniest sprout, so I'm, I don't want to... 
Oh, yeah, no, we're... Listen, whatever happens to this corn is what happens to the corn. I'm not... <laughs> I'm not worried about it. Wherever it gets to. Uh, but, yeah, they're, they're, they're only about this big, aren't they? Oh, game time? Game time. It's game time. Oh, man. All right, let me see what... Well, let me show them that prize. All right, you guys see the prize. You get these cute butterfly towels. They're really There's cute. Two, and they're so soft. And... I had to have this for you. Welcome home. Welcome Isn't it home. cute? And it's heavy. It is heavy. All right. So you get two butterfly towels in this pretty baby. I don't know which one to ask. All right. We're going to go with this one. All right. So the first person who guesses this answer correctly on our end will get to win this prize. All right. I don't know. All right, and we'll go to this one. All right, which one of these words does not appear in the title of any Indiana Jones movies? Temple, skull, rock, ark, crusade, or crystal? First person to guess it correctly will win. Again, I will repeat, which one of these words does not appear in in the title of any Indiana Jones movies. Temple, rock, I saw rock, I saw rock. rock. Kristen, Kristen is first on my side. Kristen, it is rock. Congratulations. Oh, I'm moving you, I'm moving us, not the words. <laughs> <laughs> it is rock. I, I was going through all the titles in my head and I couldn't remember them all. And I'm like, I know Crusade was the last one, but I'm like, wait, Temple of Doom. And I thought Skull, too. Whoever said Skull first, that was my first thought. Uh, but it is rock. Congratulations, Kristen. Well, you're ranking them in tonight. Congratulations. This is no, you. Rolling with my gnomies. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Congratulations. Congratulations. But it is rock. I know you guys, a lot of you came in right after Kristen. They were all rolling in, actually. There's more there's, prizes. There's more prizes. Don't <laughs> worry. But aren't they cute? We went, we had fun shopping. So we just, we have too much fun shopping. <laughs> we're not allowed to go into the store together. We really should not be allowed to go in the store together. No, because Brady I'd be home. sending everybody home with a basket. <laughs> <laughs> should not. <laughs> all right. But thank you guys. I'm glad you guys are all playing. All right, so here's some more fun stuff for you guys. This is Plum... I know you may have seen some of these, but these are super cute. Um, Plum Street Samplers. This is called Star Barks. I love her um, Dosh Hounds. They're just so cute. $10. Star Barks, number 97. I haven't seen Indiana movies, though, in a really long time. The, I, the, what was the second one, Kristen? Is that the Temple of Doom with the blonde, the lady with the blonde hair? Where they they eat the monkey? No. I don't know. Remember when they take the lids off? <laughs> <laughs> and she passes out? You remember? <laughs> that's my favorite part of the movie. <laughs> yeah, okay. So that's an order. Okay, so it was Temple of Doom. That was my favorite. Number 97, Star Barks. So there was rumors that they wanted Chris Pratt. Um, it opens tonight. Chris Pratt. They want he wanted to to do like Indiana Jones, um, but in uh, Harrison Ford says that character will die with him. He does not want anybody else doing that character, um, which is kind of cool. So it's kind of cool that they came out with another one. Right? We saw the live show in. Um, where were we? Had to be Disney or Hollywood Studios. We went, we saw the live show. That was really cool. Uh, Plum Street Samplers. This is Jeans and Weenies, number ninety eight, ten dollars. Number ninety eight, Jeans and Weenies by Plum Street, ten dollars. Yeah, I do want to see the new one. I just can't believe they did another one.
number 99, Plum Street Samplers. This is called Summer <coughs> Summer Hill, $12. I didn't want it to die. Number 99, Summer Hill. That's Plum Street. Number 100, also Plum Street. This is called Cow Pile, $10. Cow pile number one hundred ten dollars. Number one oh one. This is my favorite Plum Street samplers. This is Corgi Caboodle. Look at how cute and I just look at. <laughs> Corgi Caboodle. Isn't that adorable? Number 101, $10. Let me see. Were there any other funny questions on there? Some of these questions, the the um, the game that I pull these from is the best of TV and movies. And some of them are just so easy. But then again, it might be in, easy to me. You know what other TV movies that we really enjoyed watching? The Mummy. I love those movies. Yeah. I could watch the first two. The third one, eh. But he said he would do another one. Brendan oh, Fraser. Yeah. He's, or Fraser. I think it's Fraser. Plum Street Samplers. This is Goat Load. Number 102. $10. I would love to see another Mummy movie. Love, love, love. Have you guys ever watched? I didn't like the one with Tom Cruise. Could not get into that one at all. Well, that one was a little creepy. It was creepy. Not that the one, other one wasn't, but it had a light factor to it because he jokes and stuff, you know. But I like him as an actor. Um, I would love to see another mummy movie, but it made me feel old. The guy that played the mummy just turned sixty-five. Oh, really? Yes. I'm like, but I thought he was like twenty. When the movie came out, I'm like, how long has it been? Uh, Madame Chantilly, this is Celebrate Cross Stitch, $16. Celebrate Cross Stitch. Number 103. $16. It's a very shiny plastic, this one. The, the movie Bedazzled with him in it is quite funny, too. Mm -hmm. Number 104, also Madame Chantilly. This is called Summertime. $14. Summertime, number 104. One hundred five. This is Sugar Maple Designs. It's part of a Southern Sisters company. If you're if you are familiar, and this is called Freedom House. This is number one hundred five, and this is ten dollars. Number one hundred five. The other, actually, last weekend, I couldn't find anything on. So, what's Paramount? I think on Paramount is where you can watch The Mummy. So, I played the first one. It automatically went to the second one. And oh, then it went, I saw that when it was on. Mm -hmm, yeah. And then it kept going, and it went back to the first one again. So, we had it on for, like, all day. Because I mean, it was just in the background. We weren't really watching it, but it was on. Um, Little Robin Designs. This is called Little Liberties. $12. Number 106, Little Liberties. Number 
number 107. This is called Stitching Squirrels. Squirrel. Twelve dollars. <laughs> number one oh seven. Stitching squirrels. By the blue by the blue flower. Twelve dollars. Number one oh seven. Number one oh eight. This is by Lila's Studio, this is Noel and Blue. This is Christmas in Blue. Noel and Blue. Okay, there you go. <laughs> like Jim said. <laughs> Christmas in Blue, number 108, $14. These are quite cute. Christmas in Blue. Balance of things. Yes. Number 109. Go ahead. No, I want to hear you say it. No, you said it better than I did. Noel and Rouge. Noel and Rouge. Okay. <laughs> Christmas in Red. $14. <laughs> so we have Christmas in Blue by Lila's and we have Christmas in Red by Lila's. That's number 109. These are quite cute. Cute little gifts, cute little ornament exchange if you're in an ornament exchange. Itch now. <laughs> All right, next up, Lila Studio. This is Lila Studio. Julio. <laughs> Lila Studio. This is a Quaker Welcome. This is fifteen dollars. Number one ten. A Quaker Welcome. Number one ten. By Lila Studio. A Quaker Welcome. Number 111 by Lila Studio. This is Spring Quaker, and this is $20. Spring Quaker, number 111. Spring Quaker, $20. Another Lila Studio. This is a Summer Quaker. Twenty dollars. A Summer Quaker. I like that with the picture in the middle. Or the scene in the middle. Mm -hmm. Number one twelve. Twenty dollars. Number 113, this is Mary Jane uh, Crofts, 1841, by Lila's. This is $24. <coughs> Number 113, Lila Studio, Mary Jane Crofts, 1845. Number 113, and that's $24. Number 114, Maria de Compadre, 1896, also by Lila's. This is $20, number 114. Number 114, Would be good on that. Um, no, oh no, that's true. <laughs> yeah, no, but that Halloween truck. Oh, true. I can see those. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so <clears throat> here's some Lugana 32 count. These are two new colors and one newer color. Um, brand new. Brand new, brand spanking new. This is Lugana 32 count. This is called Pumpkin. No, it's Pumpkin. 
It's thirteen ninety five, I believe. Yes, um, the thirteen ninety five. Which is an eighteen by twenty seven inch piece, number one fifteen, and it's thirteen ninety five. So we're going a thirty two count pumpkin, number one fifteen. Great autumn color. We're going to 32 counts. Number 116, this is called granite. This is Lugana 32 count granite. It's not as dark as charcoal, but it's not as light as pewter. So it's kind of in the middle there. So it's Lugana 32, 32 count granite, number 116. Thirteen ninety five for an eighteen by twenty seven inch piece. Granite. And then next up, you've seen, you may have seen this one before. It's still one of my favorites. This is Lugana. This is a vintage Lugana, thirty two count Atlantis. This is such a fun color. It really is. This is the machine stamped Atlantis, number one seventeen, and this is fifteen ninety five. Number one seventeen, fifteen ninety five for a quarter yard cut. Such a fun color. If you do any underwater, any summer themed, this is perfect. Number one seventeen Atlantis. All right, we have another. I have another special fabric for you. Uh, this is also fifty percent off, so um, sales are fine. The final price. Um, this is Hearthside Afghan. This is the Hearthside fourteen count Afghan, but this is the color lavender and beige. So it's the lavender threads, the beige Afghan. So it's normally fifty nine ninety five. It's only twenty nine ninety five. So this is half price. Number one eighteen. Hearthside Afghan, lavender and beige. Number one eighteen, only twenty nine ninety five. Special price. I like the lavender one. Yeah. Oh, number one. Oh, sorry. Number one nineteen. Um, heartstring samplery. This is sewn in friendship. This is ten dollars. Number one nineteen. Sewn in friendship. Number one nineteen. Ten dollars. Number one twenty. Rosewood Manor. This is called Garden Visit. This is eight dollars. And you know, as usual at our summer getaway, we have lots of fun. We always have lots of fun. We may even play bingo, which that hasn't been done before, and that's because I'm fine. I want to play bingo. Well, we are playing. Bingo. We are playing bingo, but a special bingo. Special bingo. We're gonna have fun. It's gonna be so much fun. Garden visit number one twenty eight dollars. Number one twenty one Rosewood Manor. This and that nine dollars. I have another song that just popped in my head. Excuse me. This and that. And that. <laughs> <laughs> so sad, right? <laughs> number one twenty one. This. And that nine dollars by Rosewood Manor. Number one twenty two. This is pickle barrel designs. This is called Sunny Days. I think it's summer days. It's sunny days and it's six dollars. Number one twenty two. Sunny Days.
123. Um, this is by a company, a newer company, I think, Barefoot Needle Art. This is called I'll Stand By You. This is $7. I'll Stand By You, number 123. Barefoot Needle Art, $7. Number 124, cross stitch pattern, pet remembrance, $12. Number 124, $12, pet remembrance. Number 125, this is called, also by Barefoot, this is Moon Light Witch, $12. This would look really good on that Lugana 32 count pumpkin. They stitch on 18 count either, the model, but I think that would look really nice on the 32 count pumpkin. So it's number 125 and is $12. Moonlight Witch. Yeah, you know, there's nothing more fun than when you're wearing flip flops, food shopping, walking to your car, and your flip flop breaks apart. <laughs> that happened to me yesterday. <laughs> and it wasn't where the thing just popped out. The entire thing just broke right off completely. <laughs> I was like, oh, this is this is fun. So I had no shoe. <laughs> I was trying to hold the tong part between my toes to at least be able to walk within the bottom is flopping down. <laughs> like, that's what I get for wearing flip-flops. Uh, pickle Barrel, this is called Whip, or W-I-P, uh, Where Your Unfinished Projects Go, instead of uh, Rest in Peace. So that's number 129 and that's $8. <laughs> you know, you're, you're right. True. Then I probably would have like snagged some Gorilla Glue or something and tried to glue my flip flop together while I was shopping. <laughs> some scotch tape kind of <laughs> action going on. Any duct tape going on. <laughs> number 126. Number 127, this is Pickle Barrel. This is Halloween four pack. Halloween four pack. $10, number 127. Number 128 is Little Stitch Girl. This is probably haunted. If one door closes and another door opens, your house is probably haunted. <laughs> Ten dollars, number one twenty-eight. Number one twenty-eight. Number one twenty-nine. Heart in hand. These are quite popular, so we we love showing them. Halloween, tiny town. You can finish it as a flat or a frame piece or a drum. These are fourteen dollars. So number one twenty nine, Halloween Tiny Town by Heart and Hand. <laughs> Did you see? Can you read what she said? No. Kristen said, "If those ghosts can open and close doors, they can pick up a broom and help out." <laughs> <laughs> Number 130, another um, heart and hand. This is Patriotic Tiny Town. $14, number 130. Patriotic Tiny Town. Number 
and gray. This series is really so cute. Number 131, Heart in Hand. This is Seaside Tiny Town. And I think this one comes with some, some beads. Seaside Tiny Town. Number 131, $14. Every now and then I get a, your sparkler hits the light when my, I'm like, what is that? My sparkler. Your sparklers. <laughs> so. Next up is some Devosa. This is Devosa 18 count tacky. If you stitch the Prairie Schooler or Sansa, this is what they use. Devosa 18 count khaki number 132 so a quarter yard 18 by 27 inch piece will be $13.95. Devosa 18 count khaki number 132 and that's $13.95. So again this is what you would use if you're stitching the uh, prairie schooler or Sansa's. Or you can use. That's what they call for. Anyway. Number 133, Lugana 20 count. This is called Salmon. Number 133, Lugana 20 count Salmon. So 18 by 27 inch piece is 1495. Sorry. What happened? Banks failing this weekend? Army posted a little country market and then came in right this week. Oh, geez. You know, I saw something pop up and I listened to it and I didn't. Sometimes things just keep come up, right? Oh, okay, Mary. <laughs> it's okay. I saw it, then it was gone. But I did see something weird pop up this yesterday, but I, you never know what, what's real and what's not. Lugana 20 count black. Can't say anything more about black because it's black. That's okay. Yeah, I saw something too, but I don't know. Number 134. Also 1495. Lugana 20 count black. There's so much stuff out there. Sometimes I don't pay attention. Fourteen ninety five for a quarter yard. All right, so we have some more special priced items for you guys. Um, this is Vienna. This is twenty two count Victorian green. This is a twelve by seventeen inch piece. Number 135 and it's $5.50. So Vienna 22 count Victorian green, $5.50 for a 12 by 17 inch piece. That's number 135. Number 136 is tabby cloth. So this is a 17 by 17 inch piece and this is in the color daffodil. Number 136 special price for 17 by 17, $4.50. Number 137, no worries. So that's a 17 by 17, that's $4.50. Or tabby cloth and daffodil. Number 137. This is tabby cloth and this is black. Also 18 count. But this is a full quarter yard. So this is a 17, uh, 18 by 27. So it's number 137. And it's $12.50. Tabby cloth, 18 count black. Number 137 for a full quarter yard is $12.50. Number 
number 138. This is called SAR 12 count. This is yellow and white. So it's. They don't make that anymore. Yeah, I didn't think so. So for this size piece. You can turn it into a pillow, a leaning topper. It's a 17 by 17 inch square. It's $5.50 special price. So it's number 138. $5.50 special price for it. It's called SAR 12 count yellow and white. I like that little stitch that you do. Yeah. For the, it's like a little the chain. It looks yeah, like a chain, chain link. A chain link. Yeah, if you can see it, it looks like a little chain link. So the number 138 special price is $5.50. Number 138. This next fabric is called Brenda. We only have two. We only have two of these. This is a 35 by 42 inch piece fabric. It's can four. See it? I can see it. Mm -hmm. okay. It's <laughs> it's 14 count. It's three squares by four squares. So it's no matter how you're looking at it, but this way it's four across and then it's three down. This is blue and white. And again, it's 14 count. We only have two and the special price is $19.95. So this is number 139. Brenda, 14 count. 35 by 42 inch piece. Number 139. And we only have two and they're $19.95. Some of these cuts like this would look cute as like a stitch, but not necessarily a blanket, but like over the back of a couch just for decoration. Number 139, 1995. Only have two of these. So. Next up is Sambuca 28 count. They don't make this anymore either. They don't make this anymore. <laughs> this actually was very popular with Stony Creek. They have a lot of patterns, or not a lot, but a handful of patterns that they used for this. This is, I believe it's a four inch square, mm -hmm. um, 28 count. You can see the how it's woven with a unique pattern. But this is actually finished with the opening at the top for a curtain. It's all hemmed and stitched. So, so it's raw, which is a very light raw actually, and white. Um, so this is normally thirty dollars. The, today they're special for only fifteen dollars. Um, but it's just to have the fabric because they don't make it anymore. I mean, like I said, um, Stony Creek used it in several of their patterns. Um, very, it's a very beautiful fabric. I don't know why they discontinued so it. So you can either leave it as is and put a curtain rod through it because it's set up for a curtain, or cut it up. <laughs> True. <laughs> and use it for something else. So it's number 140 and that's $15. Special price, normally $30. And it is sewn and hemmed all the way around like we showed you. So it is already pre-finished. So it's number 140, $15. Special price. For special people. I think that'd be very special. All right, number 141, some uh, 36 count fabric. This is Edinburgh Flax. This is number 141, so a quarter yard is 1995. So that's an 18 by 27 inch piece. Edinburgh 36 count. Quarter yard, which is 18 by 27, is 1995. Number 142 is Edinburgh 36 count platinum. Number 142, Edinburgh 36 count platinum. 
18 by 27 inch piece is also $19.95. Edinburgh 36 count platinum. Number 143 is Newcastle. This is, a, this is such a beautiful color. I love this color. It's, um, it's called Tropical Oasis, so it's a it's a, an aqua kind of teal color with the same color metallic thread. So it's tone on tone, which is really cool. So this is Newcastle 40 Count Opalescent Tropical Oasis. And see that beautiful sparkle? Isn't it gorgeous? So that's number 143. So a quarter yard is an 18 by 27, and that's $22.95. Again, that is before the discount. So 143, Opal Tropical Oasis. Number 143. I love that sparkle and that shimmer. It's just so pretty. It's like, it looks like the water glistening. Like when yeah. light hits the top of the water. That's what it reminds me of. Be nice for like a all black, maybe like kind of silhouette, kind of um, sunset ocean <laughs> pattern. I might have to design one in my head because I don't know if it's out there. Um, here are some specials for you. This is Anne Cloth Pillow Sham. This is light teal green. Special today is only $14. It's pre-finished. My favorite uh, stitching pieces when they're pre-finished. You stitch it, stuff it, and you're done. So this is 18 count pillow sham. Light teal green, number 144, only $14. That is a special price. So that's number 144. Number 145 is also another Anne Cloth pillow sham, but this is Victorian blue. They don't even make that, these, either one of those afghans anymore, so these are nice accent pillows to have. Number 143, special price, $14. And cloth pillow sham, 18 count Victorian blue. Special price, $14. Number 145. Next up is Hearthside pillow sham. This is blue and beige with the blue ruffle. Another one, special price, number 146, only $14. These are normally $25, so they're $10 off. And this is 14 count. So number 146. Oh, oh only 99. That's not bad, Becky. <laughs> well, I, I don't want you to have the storm, so... We'll wait for the cool down, but deal with the heat. No storms. All right, next up is number 147. This is hands-on design. This is called Home of the Brave. Number 147. $12. And no storms. We had some weird weather last week, Becky. Rain almost like every day. We had hail. Um, Weird, weird storms last week. We definitely had. A lot of thunder. Yeah. I don't mind like sitting and watching. Oh. I said I, I need an, a house with a porch so I could sit outside with my cup of coffee and watch the rain and watch the storms. <laughs> I, just, <laughs> I want that. I want that. Home of the Braid, number 147, $12. Number 148, hands on design. This is called Memorial Day, $10. Oh, from, oh, was that last week? Oh, it's storming where you are, Robin? No, we're pretty, we're, we're okay here today. Where are you at, Robin? Number 148, Memorial Day. I think we're supposed to get rain now on Sunday. Oh, are we? Yeah, yeah. I think tomorrow is better. We had thought originally it was going to be on tomorrow. Mm, then, Sunday. I wonder how the because actual they, fourth is. They actually said there could be showers in the morning. On the fourth? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, North Carolina. 
Oh, okay. Well, just be safe. Uh, Hands-on design, Liberty Chalk Pull. This is nine ninety-five. Number one forty-nine. Yeah, we look. I mean, last week was pretty pretty wicked. Oh my gosh, I can't even imagine. Our hail is like so small compared to that, like minimal. Um, I mean minimal. I can't imagine seeing hail coming down the size of baseballs. I could not even imagine. What do your cars look like after that happens? I can't even. What does your house look like? I after well, that? like they just the trees, everything just comes skid. I, I don't. Can't. I don't ever want to experience that. No, I can't even imagine. <laughs> Um, Hands-on design. This is called Liberty Dwells. This comes with the um, the finishing fabric by Lady Dot Creates, and this is called Liberty Dwell. Where Liberty Dwells, and this is fourteen dollars, and it's number one fifty. Where Liberty Dwells, fourteen dollars, number one fifty. see what it looks like on the bottom there. That's the full this is the full design on the bottom. Oh. Alright, it's game time. And here's another very cute is a sunflower. I love the feel of this. A drying mat. I know I like that. And an extraordinary gnome towel. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it cute? So gnomes were had are still big but were really big. But now mushrooms apparently are very big this year. Alright. So let's see who's going to get this one right. This is not like a trivia thing. It's just a question. We'll see. All right. Which American actor's name can also be made into an anagram which reads Big Melons? It's silly, but it's funny. So I'll repeat, first person to guess correctly will win the gnome. Which American actor's name can also be made into an anagram which reads But Marianne, you got it. <laughs> Mel Gibson. <laughs> Mel Gibson. <laughs> I thought that was silly. Congratulations. I, know, I thought that was very silly. Congratulations, Marianne. That is for you. Congratulations to our winners. Did you want to do that? I don't know. Did you want to? Sure. All right. We have one more trivia for you. And this is a... This is a very special prize. It's a fairy ball. It's a, a little terrarium um, made by Miss Michelle. And she made There's this silver, on the silver moon face. And put that all together. So these are very cute. And it tells you what's inside. So this one in particular has... Um, the fairy ball is made with fine silver, moonstone chips, clover, jasmine, lavender, and moss. So this is super cute. Cute little thing to hang. Bring some good luck. So we'll do one more trivia question for this one. So let's see. Which one do we want to do? All right. Um, this I, I anticipate you guys getting this one quickly. So the first person on our end will win. What ABC primetime competition has been won by the NFL's Emmett Smith and Heinz Ward? First person to guess correctly. And you win the little fairy ball. What ABC primetime competition has been won by NFL's Emmett Smith and Heinz Ward? Ra oh, Brenda, I can't see. Brenda, you got it. It was Dancing with the Stars. Congratulations, Brenda. <laughs> that was a close one. You guys came in very quickly. But congratulations. Wow, congratulations. that was fast. I knew that one was going to go. You get the, the good luck fairy, fairy ball. ball. <laughs> congratulations. Well, thank you all for coming for joining us tonight. We hope you have a wonderful weekend. Enjoy your holiday weekend. Uh, enjoy the, the downtime. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Yes. as And, you know, just... Spend that spend that time barbecuing. Don't eat too many ribs. You Everyone. eat all the ribs you want to eat. <laughs> eat the cake. Eat the cake. No, um, but thank you guys so much. Um, we appreciate you all, and we will see you all very soon. But in the meantime, as always, happy, happy stitching. stitching. Happy Fourth, everyone. Take care. See you all soon. See you next week. <laughs>
Oh, and our flash sales this week. Oh, yes. Don't forget. We, I'm sorry. Before I shut down, we have flash sale this weekend. Don't forget to check out our flash sale. That, too, will be 25% off. So make sure you check that out. Yes, Maria, we will bring your stuff on the 12th. Debbie, we will bring your stuff on the 12th. Kristen will bring your stuff on the 8th. And Marianne, you tell me where you're going to be. Whew, did I get everybody? Oh, and Chris, too. Yep. We'll, I'll try to remember it all. No, we're, we're good. We have, it's all, if we need to refer back to the video, it's easy enough to do. All right. Take care, everybody. See you soon. Bye.